I don't think you need to worry, Nora. I'm sure Rachel is fine. You talk to me again, especially with my daughter. I'm going to hit you again. Guard! Guard, could someone please bring my stack of files on my desk or a magazine or a newspaper or something so I don't have to look at this woman? I doubt the judge will keep us here very long. Well, I guess you're very familiar with contempt of court citations. <laughs> Judging from your courtroom conduct, I'm not surprised. Okay, okay. Nora, I know what you think of me, all right? Not in detail, as a matter of fact. And since we've got so much time, I might well want to fill you in. You've been spending far too much time with your favorite client, Todd Manning. Taya, you're becoming as disgusting as he is. I thought you hit an all-time low when you put Marty Sabrick on the stand, but you know something? You outdid yourself today. Rachel gave me no choice. Oh, that is baloney. You could have demanded that her outburst be stricken from the record, but no. Instead, you put her on the stand with no preparation and tore her apart. I felt I owed that to my client. Your client is Rachel's brother, and he didn't seem very pleased with what you did. Well, I'm sure one day he will come to understand and even appreciate you think what will I did. One day, understand and appreciate what you did. I didn't start this, Nora. Rachel did. So that justifies you forcing her to tell a whole courtroom full of people that she was once a drug addict and a prostitute. Tell you. Killing Georgie Phillips was... It almost destroyed her, and you knew that, and, and, you, and you, you made her relive it. I didn't mean for it to go that far. Oh, come on! Yes, you did! You got exactly what you wanted out of her, and you loved every second of it. Now, that is not true. Why would I want to intentionally hurt Rachel? We were roommates. She was my friend, Nora. Well, if that's how you treat your friends, God help your enemies. Listen, Nora, I had to discredit what Rachel said about Dr. Evans. That meant discrediting Rachel as a witness. I'm sure you've employed a similar strategy many times. Yeah, blah, 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 nothing personal, blah, blah. That is correct. Oh my God, you've become such a machine with absolutely no feeling. That's also not true. You say you and Rachel are friends? Hmm? Yes. You've both been back in town, I don't know, how many months? How many times have you come over? How many times you called Rachel? Try to set up a play date. And I've been How busy. many times, Taya? Don't you cross-examine me. Oh, yeah, it's not fun, is it? It had to be done. Oh, yeah, because the end justifies the means. Wouldn't you do anything for a client? Oh, sure, yeah, absolutely, within my own code of ethics. Remember ethics? Did you remember ethics when you kissed your ex-husband the night before you married his brother? Oh, my God. <laughs> now you're just grabbing at anything to throw in my face, aren't you? <laughs> no. I'm just warning you. <clears throat> Don't set yourself up as a paragon of virtue. Oh, for God's sake, Tay, I'm not a paragon. I'm a human being who makes mistakes. And I'm a lawyer, sometimes a ruthless one. But mostly, I'm a mother. And that's something you'll never understand. Yes, you've pointed that out several times. You're a mother and I'm not. I get it. No, I don't think you do. Or you wouldn't have done what you did today. Do you know what it was like for me to sit there and watch you rip Rachel apart, to, to watch her suffer? <sighs> She's my child. I'm, I'm, I'm there to protect her. And Matthew? Whenever I see them in pain, do you know what I really see? I see that little baby. I see that beautiful little baby that I held in my arms. The one that I found that I would protect always with everything I have and everything that I am. I'm sorry, Nora. your child suffer at someone else's hands? How? I'm... 
I'm human. I can imagine how it must have felt for you watching Rachel go through that. And I am sincerely sorry for my part in what happened. You need to tell Rachel. I know. And I will. As soon as they let us out of here! <laughs> All right, well, here's something that you, you don't know. When people do to my kids, you do to them today, they're dead to me. Nora, no, 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 I'm not talking. I'm sitting shiver.